Last week we both saw Mystery Guitar Man's video, Light Love, and it reminded me of a little bit of light painting I did with my friend once at a campground. We blew up our tent with an RPG, so we figured, hey, let's make a light painting action movie. Everybody wants to help on this real quick, just come over here by my computer so I show you what we're doing tonight. So we're doing light painting, uh, and we're doing light painting animations. To give you an idea, yesterday we were just messing around. This is Jimmy lighting himself on fire with a flamethrower. So this is basically the action scene that we're going to do. Grant draws the gun, we bullet time spin around it as it fires, and we follow the bullet. This is one shot here, and he takes a guy out, and then there's like you know red light all, all along the, you know, the wall there as he shoots him. So the way, you know, the way this will work is that we'll, we'll set the exposure, the person will be holding the button down. So if someone gets me on the camera, holds the button down, covers it, opens it up, flash, flash, where the flash needs to be, right? right? Where the environment stuff is. Right, where the environment is. And then covers it up while then the artists move in. Each artist will probably handle one individual element, so we can do it faster. Grab lights. We have about 480 pictures. We have about 480 pictures in jail. Flash them. Ready? Yep. All right, so Sam, get in there. Go. All right, sweet. This is ridiculous. It's 5.30 in the morning, and we're putting the finishing touches on our video. If you happen to have a camera and a tripod, why don't you go out somewhere dark and give light painting a shot? All you need is a flashlight and some friends, really. It's a lot of fun, and if you send in your awesome pictures, I'll feature them on my blog at freddyw.com. I mean, go crazy. That's what's great about light paint. You can basically do whatever you can come up with. So, until next time, I'll see you guys later.